The first step on your road to success is to create your path. Creating your path is about understanding with clarity where you want to be, whether it's five years from now, 20 years from now, or even most importantly, one year from now. Make your path and stick to it. Because it's easy to go through life feeling really unclear about your purpose, where you're not too sure about who you want to be, what you want to do, and you're really just doing things just to do it. But you and I know you will never feel accomplished that way. It wastes a lot of time and energy. You won't feel like you've reached your full potential. You know deep down there's still something left in the tank. So to maximize your success and live the life that you truly want to live, make a path. Make a path based upon your passion, your curiosity, and your strengths. Think about your passion. This is where your energy lies. If you don't care about what you're doing, you will never go very far, even if the pay is good. You're only hurting yourself in the long run if the path you've chosen lacks passion. I did this in corporate America for years. Every day I was making good money, but I went home feeling miserable. I hated my job and I wanted to quit. I had zero passion about what I was doing. I knew it wasn't my true life calling and life purpose, and because of which I never gave my all. The reason why I'm sharing this with you is because I don't want you to fall victim to the same trap that I did. This is the exact same trap that gets everybody else. They grow old in these jobs, they're angry and miserable that they never turn down a different path. Don't allow yourself to be blinded by the money. All money ain't good money, let me tell you. When you find your purpose and you put your passion behind it, then the money will come. There's always a way. Where there's a will, there's a way. And that's why when you're creating your path, you have to be curious. You have to be curious that there's something about your path that truly piques your interest. It makes you get out of bed every morning and want to go on an adventure. You might be passionate about something that you really like to do, but if you don't have the curiosity to pursue a lifetime of learning in that industry and in that area. You will never reach world-class success. World-class means that you must become a learning machine. And maybe you're not curious about certain things you like to do simply because you are only doing it for fun. See, here's a key takeaway about people who have built wealth and reached massive success. People who reach success strategically place themselves in arenas where they have deep specialized knowledge, which means they know more about their industry than anyone else on the planet. They got to that level of guru status due to their curiosity of their craft. There was always something new about their industry that they wanted to learn. There was always something new about their industry that they wanted to discover. They needed the answers. It kept them up at night. So my question to you is, what's going to be your driver? What's going to be your motivator? What's going to keep you up at night in pursuit of learning? Choose a path that builds upon your strengths. What is it that you're great at doing? What do other people tell you you're great at doing? If you're spending all of your time chasing a wish that's nowhere near your strengths, you've never been good at it, you're never going to reach world-class results. Here's the question you should be asking yourself. What one thing am I so good at doing that if I put in the work and the proper amount of training, I could see myself in the top percentage of people on the planet? in this industry. Maybe you're gifted athletically. Maybe you can speak well to big groups of people. Maybe you've always been good at computers and understanding social media. But are you gifted enough that you have the potential to compete 
with the best in the world? If so, you found your sweet spot. Stick to it and be willing to put in the hours when the going gets tough. At the end of the day, your success comes down to how well you've created massive focus. Massive focus means you don't do too many things at once. You don't do everything, you do the right thing. It's so good for you to wanna, you know, it's so easy for you to wanna be good at a million things, but you cannot be great at anything if you don't take the time to focus. Always remember that good is the enemy of great. I would rather have one thing where I was a legend than have five things and be mediocre. Stick to one thing and be great. You know, it's been said in the Bible and you know other stories of multimillionaires that the key to success is about how you plant your seeds. When you plant a seed, you have to water it. If you plant too many seeds with too little water, it doesn't have enough opportunity to take root and then grow into a tree. In your life, your water is scattered around too many areas and you only have such a short amount of water supply. You want too many seeds to become trees and it doesn't work like that. Why? Because you only have one life to live. So when you design your path, remember to use massive focus. Remember that success doesn't happen overnight. Top research shows and proves that world-class success is the product of 10,000 hours of practice. Focus, sweat equity. Think about some of your famous heroes. 10,000 hours of practice and focus. Michael Jordan, 10,000 hours of practice and focus. Martin Luther King Jr., 10,000 hours of practice and focus. Jesus Christ, 10,000 hours of practice and focus and more. You name it. Whoever you look up to, you name it. No matter who you want to be or what you want to do with your life, you must be willing to put in the hours. You have to focus and have patience because success is all about leveling. You remember your favorite video game that you used to play when you were growing up? You know, being a master at leveling is just like when you were playing Super Mario Brothers. You start on one level, you work your way all the way through it, you beat all the obstacles, and then you get to the next level. Then you will advance because you deserve to advance. If you didn't put in the work, you didn't get to the next level. Now is the time for you to level up on life. All you need is the exact same strategy that you use when you were playing the game. So here's your homework. Today, I want you to pick one thing and don't give up on it. Pick your path, write out your vision and set goals behind it. Set deadlines and stick to it, man, stick with it. Be committed to sticking to it, even when the going gets tough and stay focused.